it. I look like a granddad, but I'm here for it. Mmm. Mmm. Now, I'm... Mm. Nah, I don't like this. I'm a little sunflower, short and tall. Da 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 I love these a lot. One, two, three, fuck it. My darling, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you. I love you. It's Demi. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're joining us now, welcome. Today's video, we are doing another Sheen haul. I did a Sheen haul a few months ago and I fell in love with the stuff. And I was like, I've always loved Sheen, but I'm the type of person that'll buy one or two things and I don't often buy enough things to like warrant a haul. We're doing another Sheen haul. What? So today's video, we are going to be doing a Shein haul. I'm so excited. I think these are going to be a regular occurrence on my channel this year because I'm kind of loving Shein at the minute. So if you do too, please let us know by giving this video a thumbs up. Subscribe down below. And if you're not already, get yourself a cuppa. If you haven't already got one, don't want you having a dry throat while you're watching us. The first thing that I got, I'm wearing, it's this jumper. I really like it. It's this cropped knitted jumper. It's black and white stripe. Kind of feel like I need to be on the back of a horse though. Yeah, I'm not on the back of a horse and I'm never going to be on the back of a horse. But this is the jumper and I really like it. Um, It's cropped. It's nice. It's slouchy. It's loungy. Woo! love it okay the next thing that i got i actually got a graphic tee on my last haul now i've seen this inspired by harley davidson i have a harley davidson t-shirt that i bought probably three years ago from a charity shop and i love it i love it two bits it's like it's my og it's my og and i seen she and did like fake harley davidson vintage tees and I wasn't mad at them. So I picked this one up, which I think is so, so cute. Now, if you actually read it, it doesn't actually say Harley Davidson, but you can tell that it's like meant to be a replica of them. This is what it looks like. It's just got the graphic design. I really like it. It's just a box fit and t-shirt. You've got the boxy arms, but I love this slogan. And like I said, I love vintage tees. And this was like nine, nine quid, seven quid, something ridiculously cheap. Um, Okay, this is the top. Now I've tucked it under because this is personally how I would wear it love it like first glance you would not know that this isn't a holly davison tea for what like 10 pound oh oh i think they had it in black as well so i'm quite tempted to get the black but yeah really love this this is just a cute little loungy outfit isn't it okay the next thing i'm a little bit um disappointed about now i really wanted these because i thought they looked so nice but the material of these is so heavy right that I don't feel they're going to be comfortable. I mean, I could be pretty judging, but they're, like, really, like, not that stretchy. They're just not what I envisioned. It's a pair of, like, joggers come trousers. Now, they're black. They have got a little tie at the front, but they just feel really, really heavy. Like, they feel quick. Maybe they're meant to be. Maybe they're, like, meant to be really thick, but they don't feel like they've got much stretch in them as well. Actually, they do. They are stretching quite well there. But I don't know. They're just not what I envisioned them to be. They are a black ribbed material, and then... They just come down into a little cuffed arm so they're kind of meant to be like a jogger but i just expected a different material so when they came and they were this stiff material i was a bit like whoa mate what you doing but we're gonna try them on anyway see what we think of them on i definitely shouldn't have prejudged these leggings well leggings joggers pants whatever you want to call them because they are amazing they are so thick quality like it's honestly unreal i love these uh lot i really like them i'm sorry i ever judged you please don't hate us oh my god i'm obsessed with this like i literally cannot deal with how much i love this this is a little high neck turtleneck rib t-shirt but look at that it's got little sunflowers embroidered how flipping cute and then you've just got long arms and it is cropped this is so me like i love it now it does feel kind of like more thin material it's not like really thick but i love it this embroidered thing just had a sold i just think it's so cute and i love yellow so it just spices up a little black outfit doesn't it oh my god i love this this is so cute i love 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 this little top i'm a bit, a bit embroidery i'm a sucker for it embroidered bloody nipples on a top and i'll want it i love embroidery this is so cute oh my god this is a cute little set as well Ooh, 
I'm a little sunflower, short and tall. Da 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 da. Done. The next thing I got, now I actually got a pair of pants like this not long ago but I seen these leggings on Sheen and they're just black leggings with a white stripe. Now I can tell they're not going to be squat proof because you can see my hand through them like uh, uh. but I think you know everyday wear they might be quite nice. This is what they look like. They're just plain. They just got that. By the way, Aunt Sheen, I got everything in a 1XL. Um, but yeah, they're just plain black leggings with the white stripe giving you that Nike Adidas vibe. And I just really wanted to get them because I'm going through a lot of leggings recently. Not going through them as in like chucking them away, but like I wear a pair, they get all sweaty. So then I put them in the wash and I need quite a few pairs of leggings. And because we're only doing home workouts at the minute, even if they're not squat proof, I'd still wear them to do a home workout because... You know, it's only the parrot and the dog that could see right through it, is, so see right through it. Is, uh. About it's quite a basic item. It's just a little shift dress, but it's got a little butterfly on it. My mum's gonna love this. She loves butterflies. But I thought this is so so cute. Now I feel like I would wear this, but not even layer it. I feel like in the summer this would just look really cute. Um, maybe I would belt it. Actually, no, I wouldn't. I would not belt this. This would not look cute with a belt. But yeah, I just really liked it. The butterfly had my heart, fell in love with it. So I thought, ooh, let's try that out. Oh my God, this is so simple, but yet so cute. Look at me little butterfly. Oh, I actually really like the style of this dress. Like I think it looks so nice on holiday. Actually, even just with some converse, I think this is so cute with the denim jacket, maybe. I'm not into denim jackets at the minute though, you know. I like them but I feel like they're one of them things that quickly go in and out of phase and at the minute they're just not a phase for me but I really like this little dress anyway this isn't about denim jackets okay the next thing that I got I'm really excited about it is just a little high neck top and it's just got a more a more I don't know how you pronounce that it's got little short arms on it but I feel like I would put a t-shirt over this and just have the embroidered thing sticking out at the top but yeah it's pretty basic just a rib tee with the little embroidery at the top but i really like it and like i said we know i love layering so this this i was really intrigued by this is a knitted dress but i don't know i like it it's got a v-neck and it's got red going down the side of it and it's like a jumper dress but it's not like really a jumper it is knitted but it's not like a jumper do you know what i mean you know what I'm saying? But yeah, I really like it. It's got quite a thick arm on it. I just think this was so, so pretty. Um, and I really wanted to try it out. So I thought I would get it to try. Mm. Mm. Now, I'm... Mm. Nah, I don't like this. Looks a bit weird. I had an envision in my head and it, it just doesn't look like the vision. It looks just a little bit weird, I feel. Maybe you all think different, or maybe I could style it somehow. Maybe if I put like a little top underneath, I know, I layer all the time, I know what you're gonna see, but I feel like I need to style it somehow, cause it just looks like. I feel like Harry, my best mate, you know, Harry in Wales. I think he's gonna love this. I think this is him. It's a beige cardigan, but it's like two-tone beige. Well, it's beige and brown. This is the brown side. This is the beige shade. We've but yeah, this is what it looks like. It's got a beige shade and a brown side. I really, really like it. It's got like cute little arms on it. Um, but yeah, I just thought this was so cute. And you know, I love the cardigan style at the minute. And this is like definitely colour wise out my comfort zone. But I thought, you know what? I'm going to try it. I really like the two tone on it. Eight. I look like a granddad, but I'm here for it. Roll these cuffs up. Get them rolled. Oh! Demi's jumped on the beige brown trend eventually. Huh! I love it. I feel like beige is one of them colours though that when you start wearing it, you could quite easily get addicted. Because I put this on in the mirror and I was like, oh, oh, oh. And now I kind of feel like I need some more beige stuff. But I need to contain myself, Demi. Lockdown isn't an excuse to spend. But I do. I, I like it. I do. I like it a lot. I really like it. That is everything that I got from Sheen. I really hope that you enjoyed this video and I hope you like my Sheen hauls. If you want us to continue doing them, please give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe down below if you've got, if you like hauls because I do them regularly. If you don't, don't worry, you can still subscribe because I do plenty of other videos. But without further ado, -ta -ta, I'm going to let you go and I will see you very shortly for another video. Bye!